Okay, Google, turn on yellow bulb. Alexa trigger, turn off yellow bulb. Sending that to event. Now before starting this video, I will suggest you to watch out my previous video in which I have explained all about the hardware, the coding and also about configuring Ubidot accounts for this particular project. So after completing that, now you need to have an app called IFTTT installed on your smartphone. It's available both for Android and iOS. I will attach its link in the description. Open that app and make an account in it. After making an account, click on My Applets. Now click on this plus icon. Now click on this. Here search for Google Assistant. Select say a simple phrase. Here click on connect button and select the Google account whose Google Assistant you will be using. Click on allow. That's it. Now type whatever you want to say to your assistant. I will type as turn on yellow bulb. Now here you can write optional statements like yellow bulb on, turn yellow bulb on likewise. And in the end you need to type whatever you want your assistant to say in response. I will type as OK turning on yellow bulb. Now click on this create button. Here click on that. Now search for webhooks. Select make a web request. Now here you need to paste this particular link with some changes. I have attached this link in the description of this video so you can get it from there. So first of all, here you need to type your device name, which you can get by going into your Ubidots account and selecting this device button. So here is my device, which is named as ESP32. So I will write here as ESP32. Now here you need to paste your token number, which you will get from your Ubidots account from this API credential section. Just copy this token and paste it here. That's it. So this is your personalized link. Below you have to select the method as post, content type as application slash JSON and in the body you need to type the variable name and the data in this particular format. So in my case I want to turn on the bulb which is attached to relay 14. So I will write as relay 14 and after this colon I will write 1 as I want to turn on the bulb. Okay, now click on create action button. So this will create one applet for turning on the bulb using your Google Assistant. Similarly, we can create for turning off the bulb by just changing the data to zero instead of one. But I won't be showing you this. Rather, I will create one more applet of turning off the bulb, but this time using Amazon Alexa. So, okay, let's repeat the process. Click on this plus icon. Now click this. Here search for Amazon Alexa. Now click on say a specific phrase. Here also click on connect. Now sign in with your Amazon account. Here type a phrase like turn off yellow bulb. Click on create trigger. Now we need to follow the same step which we have followed previously. So click that. Select webhooks. Select make a web request. Here paste that same link with your device name and your token number. Select post in the method, content type as application JSON and in the body type your variable name which in my case is relay 14 colon 0 in this particular format. Here I have written 0 as I need to turn off the bulb. Now click on this create action button. So we have successfully made another applet for turning off the bulb using Amazon Alexa. Likewise, you can make several applets in IFTTT for controlling multiple appliances either using Google Assistant or Amazon Alexa. So we have successfully created the applets for turning on and off. Now let's just see this particular thing in action.
Okay Google, turn on yellow bulb. So yeah, this was all about this video. I hope you enjoy this video. Subscribe my channel if you haven't to watch more such amazing project tutorials. Other than projects, I also used to upload some getting started videos on electronic components or products, some explained videos on different technology or sensor, and some short but useful tips and tricks. So just wait for my next video and then explore, learn, share with me, Techie SMS.